Hello students, let's do rational numbers exercise 2D. Page number 39, question 6, divide. Now we are beginning with division. So let's follow the steps carefully. First, let's write down the question. So what do we have here? We have 15 by 28, 15 by 28 divided by 3 by 4. So when we do division of rational numbers, we write down the first one as it is. So 15 by 28, the first rational number, we write it as it is. Now division changes into multiplication and the second rational number that we have, that is 3 by 4, we write the reciprocal of 3 by 4 or the multiplicative inverse as we call it. So we're going to write the reciprocal of 3 by 4, which is 4 by 3. So now here, 4 by 3. So now we have a question 15 by 28 into 4 by 3. Now here we can cancel whatever we can because it's regular multiplication. So let's cancel 3 and 15. Both are divisible by 3 itself. 3 1s are 3 and 3 5s are 15. We can also cancel 4 and 28. 4 1s are 4 and 4 7s are 28. Now what do we have here? We have the numerators 5 into 1. 5 into 1 is 5 and the denominator is 7 into 1. Multiply the denominators 7 into 1 which is 7. So our final answer here is 5 by 7. Question 2. So here let's write down this question minus 20 by 9 divided by minus 5 by 9. Okay, so we begin by writing the first rational number as it is minus 20 by 9. Division changes to multiplication. And we write the reciprocal of the second rational number. So minus 5 by 9 will now become 9 by minus 5. This is the reciprocal. Now let's cancel what we can. We can cancel this minus sign which is in the numerator and the minus sign which is in the denominator. We can also cancel 20 and 5 both by 5 itself. 5 1s are 5 and 5 4s are 20. Now we can cancel 9 and 9. 9 1s are 9 and 9 1s are 9. So now we have our numerators 4 into 1 which is 4 and our denominators 1 into 1 which is 1. So 4 by 1 is 4. So our final answer here is 4. Question 3. 16 by minus 5. Let's write it down. 16 by minus 5 divided by minus 8 by 7. So let's begin. 16 by minus 5 will remain as it is. Division will change to multiplication. Minus 8 by 7 will now become 7 by minus 8. Now what can we cancel here? We can cancel 8 and 16 both by 8 itself. So 8 1s are 8 and we put the minus sign. 8 2s are 16. Now there's nothing else that we can cancel. So we multiply the numerators. 2 7s are 14 and we multiply the denominators. Minus 5 into minus 1. Minus into minus is plus. 5 ones are 5. So this is 14 by 5, which is an improper fraction. Let's convert it to a mixed number. So let's divide 14 by 5. 5 twos are 10 minus, we have the remainder 4. So what will this be? 2, 4 by 5. So this is our final answer. Question 4, minus 7. So let's write that down. Minus 7, we'll give it the denominator 1 divided by minus 14 by 5. So the first rational number remains as it is, minus 7 by 1. Division changes to multiplication. We write the reciprocal of the second one. So this becomes 5 by minus 14. Now let's see what we can cancel. I can cancel the minus sign in the numerator and denominator. I can also cancel 7 and 14, both by 7. 7 ones are 7, 7 twos are 14. Now let's multiply the numerators. 1 into 5 is 5. And in the denominator, we have 1 into 2. 1 twos are 2. So 5 by 2, which is an improper fraction, let's convert it to a mixed number. So 2, 2 twos are 4 minus 1. So what do we have here? 2 1 by 2, which is our final answer. Question 5. Similar sum. So minus 14 by 1 divided by 7 by minus 2. 
So here the first one remains as it is, minus 14 by 1. Division changes to multiplication and we write the reciprocal of the second one. So it becomes minus 2 by 7. So what can we cancel here? We can cancel 7 and 14. 7 ones are 7 and 7 twos are 14. Now let's multiply the numerators. We have minus 2. So this is minus 2 into minus 2. Minus into minus is plus. Two twos are 4. And denominator we have 1 into 1. 1 ones are 1. Now plus 4 is 4 itself. 4 by 1 is 4. So our final answer here is 4. Question 6. Minus 22 by 9 divided by 11 by 18. So this is our question. Let's begin the sum. So minus 22 by 9. Division changes to multiplication. 11 by 18. We write the reciprocal. 18 by 11. Now let's cancel all that we can. We can cancel 11 and 22. 11 ones are 11. 11 twos are 22. And the minus sign comes with it. 9 and 18 also, 9 ones are 9, 9 twos are 18. Now let's multiply the numerators. That is minus 2 into 2. That will be minus 4. 2 twos are 4. Let's multiply the denominators. 1 into 1 is 1. Minus 4 by 1 is minus 4. Question 7. 35, let's write it as 35 by 1 divided by minus 7 by 9. So the first rational number remains as it is, 35 by 1. Division changes to multiplication. Reciprocal becomes 9 by minus 7. So now we do the cancelling. We can cancel 7 and 35. 7 ones are 7, so that's minus 1. And 7 fives are 35. Nothing more to cancel, so let's multiply the numerators. 5 into 9. 5 nines are 45. And the denominators 1 into minus 1, which is minus 1. So here we can remove the minus sign from here and put it here on top. So now our answer is minus 45 by 1, which is simply minus 45. Question 8. 21 by 44 divided by minus 11 by 9. So this is 21 by 44, division changes to multiplication and we write the reciprocal so it becomes 9 by minus 11. So what can we cancel here? We can cancel nothing as you can see there is nothing that can be cancelled. So in that case we multiply the numerators and we multiply the denominators. So let's see what we get. 21 into 9, 9 ones are 9, 9 twos are 18. So that's 189 in the numerator. Now denominator is 44 into minus 11. The sign is minus 44 into 11. So that is 44. 1 into 44 is 44. 0 again. 1 into 44 is 44. Now we add this up. 4, 8 and 4. So what do we have? Minus 484. So here we write our answer as minus 189 by 484. This is our final answer. Question 7, evaluate. And here we have addition. So first let's write this down. 3, 5 by 12 plus 1, 2 by 3. First step is conversion. So let's convert. 12 threes are 36 plus 5. 36 plus 5 is 41. 41 by 12 plus, now let's convert here, 3 ones are 3 plus 2 is 5. 5 by 3. Now we have to find the LCM of the denominators because they are unlike. They are different, isn't it? So let's find the LCM of 12 and 3. So here I can start this with 3. 3 fours are 12 and 3 ones are 3. Now I can use 2. 2 twos are 4 and 1. Again, I can continue with 2. 2 ones are 2 and I bring down 1. Now my LCM will be 3 into 2 into 2. So that is 3 twos are 6, 6 twos are 12. So 12 is the LCM which I am going to use as the common denominator. So 12 we have here. 12 
ones are 12 so 41 into 1 41 into 1 is 41 plus go to the next one 3 into what is 12 3 fours are 12 to multiply 5 also by 4 5 fours are 20 now 41 plus 20 is 61 by 12 which is an improper fraction let's convert it to a mixed number 61 divided by 12 12 fives are 60 so what's remaining is 1 so what is our mixed number here 5 1 by 12 and this is our final answer question 2 3 5 by 12 it's the same as the previous question the only thing is this is subtraction 1 2 by 3 so first let's convert this 12 threes are 36 plus 5 is 41 so this is 41 by 12 minus let's convert this also three ones are three plus two is five so that is five by three as you can see the denominators are different 12 and 3 so let's find the LCM of the denominators you can start with three three fours are 12 and one now we can use two two twos are four one and again continue with two two ones are two and one now the LCM is 3 into 2 into 2. 3 twos are 6, 6 twos are 12. So this is our LCM which we are going to use as a common denominator here. So this is 12. Now 12 ones are 12 so we multiply 41 also by 1. 41 into 1 is 41 minus the other one here is 3. 3 fours are 12 so 5 into 4. 5 fours are 20. Now let's minus 41 minus 20, which is 21. 21 by 12. Now this is an improper fraction, so let's convert it to a mixed number. 21 divided by 12. 12 ones are 12. Minus, so let's borrow here, 11 minus 2 is 9. So here we get 1, 9 by 12. Now 9 by 12 can be reduced to the lowest term. 1 will remain as it is. Let's reduce 9 by 12 to the lowest term by dividing both by a common factor which is 3. Now 3 into what is 9? 3 threes are 9. So let me write that as a numerator. And in the denominator 3 into 4 is 12. So my final answer here is 1, 3 by 4. Question 3. Now here we have questions in brackets. So what we need to do first is we have to remove the brackets of this one and then remove these brackets and get our final answer. So let's begin with the first one. So here we have 3, 5 by 12 plus 1, 2 by 3. So first step is conversion. So we're going to work out this set of brackets first. 12 threes are 36 plus 5 is 41. 41 by 12 plus 3 ones are 3 plus 2 is 5 so that is 5 by 3 then here we have to find the LCM and write that so 12 and 3 we have done this before but we will still do it again we'll find the LCM 3 fours are 12 and 3 ones are 3 we continue with 2 2 twos are 4 and 1 2 ones are 2 now, LCM will be 3 into 2 into 2. So, 3 twos are 6, 6 twos are 12. LCM is 12. So, 12 is a common denominator here. So, let's find the numerators. 12 into 1 is 12. So, 41 into 1 is 41. So, this is 41. Plus, the other side we have 3 into 4 is 12. So, 5 into 4 is 20. So here we have 41 plus 20, which is 61. 61 by 12. So this is the first part. Now we have to find the second part. So here it says divided by this part. So let's write that down. 3, 5 by 12 minus 1, 2 by 3. Since the conversion has already been done, we won't waste time with that. It's the same thing. 3, 5 by 12, 3, 5 by 12. When you convert, you get 41 by 12. So let's write that 41 by 12 minus 
Now here we have 1, 2 by 3. We also have 1, 2 by 3 here. We converted and we got 5, 3. 5 by 3 which we will write here. 5 by 3. So let's write that one. So now what do we have here? We have 41 by 12 minus 5 by 3. So we have to find the LCM of 12 and 3 which we have already found. LCM of 12 and 3 we found it to be 12. So let's write that. So that will be common denominator 12. Now 12 ones are 12. So 41 into 1 is 41. So this is 41 minus 3 into 4 is 12. So 5 into 4. 5 fours are 20. So what do we have here? 41 minus 20 is 21 by 12. Now we have to divide 61 by 12 and 21 by 12 as given in the question. So let's do that now. 61 by 12 divided by 21 by 12. Now how did we get the 61 by 12? We worked out this. We removed the brackets and we got 61 by 12. We removed the brackets here and we got 21 by 12. According to the question, we should divide the two answers. And we know how division is to be done, isn't it? So we write down the first rational number as it is, 61 by 12. Division will change to multiplication. And we write the reciprocal of the next rational number. So 21 by 12 will now become 12 by 21. So let's cancel what we can. We can cancel 12 and 12. Both are divided by 12 itself. So that's 12 ones are 12 and 12 ones are 12. Now 61 and 21. Now we can't cancel. So we are just going to write the numerator 61 into 1. It's 1 here. So that's 61. And here it is 1 into 21. That's 21. So since we can't cancel, we have multiplied the numerators and the denominators. But 61 by 21 is an improper fraction. We're going to convert it to a mixed number. 61 divided by 21. 21 twos are 42. So that's minus. So this is 5, 11. 11 minus 2 is 9. 5 minus 4 is 1. So here our answer will be 2, 19 by 21. So we'll stop with this for now, children. We will continue with the remaining questions in our next video. Thank you, children.